Look at that fish for you. Welcome to another edition of Don Alfin on Fishing. Today we're out at, uh, at uh, Lake Trout Heaven in uh, Flaming Gorge and Colton Christensen's with me and he just hooked his first fish and we're going to see it come through the ice right here, hopefully. How does it feel? It feels like a good one. It looks pretty good. It actually, seeing it through the ice down here, that's a dandy fish. Wow, look at that pup. Yeah. <laughs> you think we can take that pup? Them are good eating. <laughs> It's a nice fish. Okay, so you just had your banana spoon on, right? Yeah, the yellow banana good spoon. Good old you yellow banana spoon and a little bit of tipped with a little bit of nightcrawler today. Yep. So fantastic. Fan fantastic. I'm gonna get out of the sun here just a little bit and take a shot of, of Colton. And so what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be throwing basically dropping spoons to him today. We'll try several different things. This fish came up. 30 feet from the bottom to grab that to grab your banana spoon as it was going down. I was watching it on the finder. Yeah, I was going down and he was coming up. Yep. Hey, well thanks again for watching and I hope we can put a few more fish on the ice. Does that feel 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 like it's a decent fish again? Yeah, another one of these. Good job. Yeah, <laughs> good. That's a little bit, a little oh, bit smaller one, but that's okay. I'll take it. These are the kind we need to get out of the lake. So we're doing great. Well, that only took you about three minutes since your last one. Yeah. You gotta let me get down and start fishing, Colt. Got no bait on this, but I'm sending it back down. Well, I've got about eight or ten fish. Just, gosh, just about ten feet behind me, right there. Or no, behind me is over here, sorry. Got him. Doesn't feel too large, but it's a fish. And we're happy to see him. Come up through that ice, baby. There we go, that's a little baby. <laughs> that's all right. He's got another one. There we go. That's another decent sized one. Good job. Good job. That came on the, the, the yellow uh, banana again, right? That's the only pole I've got out. <laughs> Same as me. I've just got a chartreuse, <laughs> a chartreuse one too. So. I'm going to have to get, see this one from afar because I'm trying to catch my own fish right here. There, I missed him. Doggone it. <laughs> I was watching you and missed the hook set. <laughs> that like a better fish. There you go. Oh, he just got home. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I just had a, one of those rockfish, I'm sure. <laughs> a good one, but it's one. Yeah, that's a better fish. There we go. <laughs> nice pup. And he's off. <laughs> we'll take him. Just throwing my good old chartreuse. This one happens to be a coconator, but I've got everything else I've got on is the are the ones that Colton sells. At Lakeshore Tackle, but uh, off a good bait. Oh, I missed him. No, I got him. I got him. That's a decent size. Not too big, but good to get him out of the lake. I think I can use that 
Nightcrawler again. Because I've got more fish down there if I can just get down to them in time. They hit, but they didn't hit hard enough to take, to hit the, to set the hook on. Like they were trying to just eat the night crawler. All we're doing here is we're watching our finder. I have a Garmin um, uh, ice fishing bundle that I picked up this year. And we're just getting used to it, just getting used to how it works. But uh, it is really cool because you can see the fish basically real time, just like I could on my old Vexilar. And you can watch them come into the screen because because we're watching a little bit wider area than the Vexilar would uh, would show. And so if you can look down there, and I don't know if you can see it, I'm not quite on the right angle, but there's a hill that we're on, and uh, and all we're doing is just fishing this hill. And I'm I'm up at the uh, top end of the hill, and Colton, right over there, is over at the down at the uh, uh, towards the middle of the hill. And so uh, we can see the fish, and generally I can fish them, and then they'll continue on down the hill, and, and uh, Colton can fish them. So that's all we're doing, just putting a little bit of a, of a, of a worm tip instead of maggots on a, on a chartreuse uh, coconator. And, uh, and uh, Colton is using one of his banana spoons, half-ounce banana spoons, um, in chartreuse as well. He calls it yellow. I call it chartreuse. But uh, that's what we're fishing with, and it's uh, been quick so far. We got six fish on the ice. We've been fishing for just about an hour, so that's pretty good for an hour's work. Come on, baby, take it. <laughs> Little hesitant to take. You got a bunch on yours. Are coming to you? I know, I see it. Wow! Look at that bunch of fish right there. Can you see those fish on the finder? Right there, right over the top of Colton right now. Got him. Yep. There we go. That's a decent sized one. He wanted it. Take your time with him. We're everything's good. There he is. There. <laughs> little lake trout. Nice job. Still on the on the yellow, right? Yep, on the yellow. With a little bit of night crawler. See what we got. Feels like it's fairly heavy. We got a burbot? <laughs> I don't think a burbot pulls like I that. I don't think a burbot pulls like that either, but you never know. Oh, oh he can't have got off. That's too bad. Well, we'll see if this one stays on. Been missing a few lately. This was down at 75 feet. Kind of playing around trying to get caught on the ice. I hope I can make it through the ice. There he goes. There he goes. You saw him. He got away, but you got to see him. <laughs> well, that you didn't even give me a chance to say hi to that fish. You just got it in. Good job. Really good job. You know, chartreuse has been the thing. Yep, that's all my all, fish. All day long, for sure. That's awesome. Add it to the pile. Mm -hmm. Feels like a better fish. Yeah, it's a good fish. Come help. Okay. 
There we go. Nice job. <laughs> That's a nice pup. <laughs> you know what? I saw that from clear over there. And it looked like it was 30 feet. And it looked like it was 30 feet away. And it was hanging 30 feet down. So I came over completely blind. Just dropped down to where I assumed was 30 feet. And started jigging. And there's the fish. <laughs> Nothing wrong with them apples, huh? Nope. <laughs> I say those apples, you can say them apples. <laughs> you got one coming, huh? Small one, but I got him. That, <laughs> that took the took the record for the smallest one. That's okay. That just means that you can catch small ones too. Yeah. <laughs> Show that to the camera. And hold it way out in front. <laughs> If we can make this Let's thing 30 look, pounds. Look huge. Right there. Oh, look at that enormous fish. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Show uh, the audience that little banana spoon that you've been, been using. Is that a half ouncer? This is a half ounce banana spoon in the yellow. In the yellow. And uh, we're not worrying about glow or anything like that uh, right now, but just tipping it with a little bit of night crawler. Uh, we've both had a bunch of fish and a lot of bites that we haven't caught, but. Uh, uh, thanks again for watching. Uh, subscribe to the channel. Uh, oh, wait a second. Colton, do you have that same fish finder that I have? I do. <laughs> what do you think about it? They're awesome. <laughs> well, here we are. We've got 11 nice fish on the ice. We lost several more at the, at the, uh, right at the ice as we were bringing them through the ice. I lost a, 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 a dandy and so did uh, Colton. But um, 11 fish, uh, we fished for about uh, five hours and um, moved around a lot, but we had so much fun. <laughs> did, you, did you have some fun there, Colton? <laughs> yeah, it was good times. <laughs> so um, thanks for watching today's episode. We're, um, we, we tried to show you that we're, we're fishing some spoons uh, today, uh, tipped with uh, Nightcrawler. Um, we, um, we didn't see anything but pup lake trout. We didn't uh, see any kokanee, or we didn't certainly didn't see any burbot. So, but we weren't after them anyway, so we had a great time. Hope you enjoyed watching today's episode. Thanks again for watching, and make sure you subscribe to the channel if you haven't.